All right, today we are gonna be working on the Bozo car. As you know, we have a bunch of the rear end in primer. Uh, the other side, the passenger side doors are in primer. We're going to try and get these both to the same stage. Then we're gonna get the roof to the same stage just because this stuff is super easy and we can try and get this done in a day or so. Since you've last seen, we haven't gotten very much work done on these doors or the roof. That's because we're gonna be holding off for that for now, uh, just because uh, I really want to make sure that we do that 100% before we put it in any sort of primer. I just don't want to do this initial primer thing and just be wasting time. So I went ahead and started doing the back because as soon as we put the trunk on, I knew I wanted to start working on getting these taillights in. You can see I have them marked out where I wanted. Uh, I was figuring this out for a little bit now, drilling some holes, but I'm pretty excited to be able to see these taillights in here for the first time. And it should be no problem drilling the holes and getting them somewhat mounted up, at least temporarily, just to see how it looks. Now that we have the holes cut and trimmed so that way the bezels can fit in there because they do protrude into it a little bit. We had to widen it a little bit more than I thought. Now that it's good, we have to drill the holes for the taillights to be able to sandwich the fiberglass. So as you can see that usually there are the studs that go into the back of here. We're gonna have to drill holes for these to go through the fiberglass and then pinch in this taillight. So we're gonna take some paper, make a template, that way we can put it up against the car, make it perfect, and from there be able to drill our holes as accurately as possible. We have since taken the tail lights out. I've been working on some other stuff and continued to clearance back there and uh, try and get that inside part kind of uh, nice looking for when it's all finished. Um, but yes, we were using the jack and another jack handle to kind of simulate how the exhaust is gonna be. Um, it was just kind of funny, but we put the slit spoiler on there and I think it looked really good. Everything was just tying together real well. The only problem was this car is not low enough. It just doesn't look really that right at the height that it's at. Uh, but I did order my tires, so they are on their way from Germany, which is kind of crazy. But uh, it's just what I had to do to get the specific size that I wanted. Anyways, we'll get those within a few weeks, hopefully. Anyways, guys, this is where I'm gonna be finishing out today's video. And if you are interested in helping out the channel and the progression of this build, go ahead and pick yourself up some merchandise. We have these new sweatshirts back 
Pretty cool design, not car related, but if you wanna pick one up, it helps out the channel tremendously. We also have the Bozoko style and the Miata ones as well. Anyways, guys, that is it for today. Hope you enjoyed and peace out.